Hello beauties and welcome back to the channel. I'm Just Geek the Dancing Avon Lady and today we're talking about a brand new lip care routine courtesy of the FMG Glimmer Lip Polish and Lip Conditioner. So let's do this. So you guys know how obsessed I am about lip care products and well just lip products in general. I love some lip products. It's a bit of an obsession to be honest with you. My current routine right now for lip care has really been the vitamin C line which is includes the lip scrub and the overnight light mask. It is a beautiful pairing and when I saw that the RFMG line is now coming out with a lip polish and the lip conditioner I was like Add to cart now. So what we're going to do first is we're going to test out the lip polish followed by as recommended using the lip conditioner and then an optional step after that is to pair it with your lip product or lip color of the day which for me today is going to be the FMG Cashmere Lip Cream in Plush Painty. So we're going to be doing all of that today but before we get started if you are brand new to this channel welcome please do hit that subscribe button as well as the little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. The first thing we're going to talk about is going to be this lip polish. So this is called the FMG Glimmer Lip Polish. According to Avon it is an essential step to all of your lip care needs. It gently uses um, sugar to buff away dead skin to help prep your lips to really take in a conditioner absorb it in and also for of course a smoother lipstick application now if you are a person who loves to wear more of a matte lipstick or using lip stains this is definitely something you need to have in your life or some sort of lip polish because I find that if there is a bit of skin that is thicker or looser for especially for a lip stain what's gonna happen is going to catch on more pigment and your lips will just look uneven for this particular one it's supposed to complement all other lip products so you can use this in pairing with pretty much anything that you want. Upon completion, it's supposed to help leave your lift soft and supple. It is travel friendly because as you can see, it is teeny tiny, which is always fun. And so it, because I think it's a tube, you can even just put it into your overnight bag or put it into your purse for those midday lip scrub emergencies. The key ingredients includes uh, sugar, which gently buffs and smooth away dry, flaky skin. Vitamin E, which helps to moisturize, soothe, and heal your dry lips. Squalene, which helps to soften and replenish lips. And we talked about squalene before when I was talking about the Isonox line, I believe. And then also a multi-fruit berry extract. Oh, that's interesting because it leaves your lips feeling supple and pampered. And also, of course, berries, as we know, has a lot of antioxidant benefits. Let's open this up first first. Oh, oh, it's actually a deeper red than I thought. I thought it was going to be a brighter red because in the pictures it looks like a really bright red. I really like the fact that it is in the tube because it is something easy to carry around. I can throw it in my purse and also I don't have to think that I might be contaminating any part of it by using my fingers dipping it in. I can just squeeze a little bit out, buff, 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 buff away. So you start off in the center and then you just move your way out. You remove it with a washcloth. What I'm going to be removing it with is our Bamboo Reusable Makeup Remover pads. I can't think of the exact name, but you know what I'm talking about. If not, it's all going to be in the description box anyways. And then of course, following with our lip conditioner and our lipstick. So let's open this baby up first. Let's do a quick swatchy swoo here. Oh, it actually has a little bit of a pink tint. I thought it was just going to be white. Look at that. It's a little pink. Oh, it smells. Oh, you can smell the berries in it. That's really nice. So it has like a really fine scrub and it is a little thin. Thick. Okay, so but I'm sure that after you start using it, you're going to be able to like warm it up with your body heat and it'll thin out. I really like the scent of it. The scent is like berries and sweet. So let's try this on the lips right away. I'm going to put a little bit on my finger. Now I'm going to start rubbing. I don't know why I use my left finger. I'm much better with my right. It's not overly abrasive. You can definitely feel mm, a little bit just fell on my tongue. <laughs> Mm. All right, don't eat it just. I'm just brushing it away very gently. You know, I've been actually neglecting my lips a little bit. I have not done a scrub in quite a few weeks now. So this, my lips would be like, Hello, you love me again. And my lips have been feeling a little bit drier. I think it's because I've been outside a lot. And also the other day we had a barbecue, which is very, in Chinese, we call it yeet hei. And so it's not the best thing for your skin. 
It's sweet. Yum. Yum. Don't eat this, guys. It's not something to be eaten. But it's, if you get a little bit on your tongue, let's just say it's yum. <laughs> My body heat, it definitely did melt the material melt the um the the base of it i like how it feels it feels really nice it's like nice and fine and it doesn't feel too crazy abrasive so this is after it's been on for that chunky lip look let's wipe this off there's a little bit left so i just dampened my cloth a little bit just get it out of any of the ex anything extra so you can see that it did flake off some there's still a little bit left but like i said i've been having a little bit experiencing dry lips and what i love about lip scrubs is it always makes my lips feel more plump and enhance the, the natural color of my lips that's what i find anyways after that what you're going to do is you're going to use the lip conditioner which is this now i believe i believe if memory serves me right this is just a repackaging of our very 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 popular fan favorite lip conditioner that used to be called beyond color i think the only difference with this one is that it does not have spf in it so if you are looking for something with spf you're going to want to put another spf lip balm on top of it but this will be great for nighttime or just layering it oh my gosh but look at this packaging here i love it that it's red and then black i think that's really hot so this conditioner it preps and primes your lips for a nourished and smooth finish because it does have a cushioned buttery texture which offers according to avon superior moisturization it has a lot of skin loving ingredients inside of it that will help protect your lips as well as to so a soothe and replenish dry cracked lips such as this so that'll be very very good and today Day's lip situation. Also supposed to pair flawlessly with other lip products that we have. Uh, it has a soft shine finish so it's not going to be matte, it's not going to be shiny although I mean if you guys love this shiny look try out the Drunk Shiny Lip Oil from Tipsy. Oh my gosh guys, mind blown love obsession with that product. It's cruelty free, it's also peer free from parabens, talc sulfates, uh, phthalates and alcohol. The key ingredients in this includes vitamin E so if you're using these together you're going to end up getting a double dose of vitamin E it's also formulated with jojoba and sunflower seed oil to help uh, protect against free radicals and the final thing is that, that it has mango seed butter which is rich in fatty acids to provide a, an intense amount of moisturization to your skin all great stuff so let's open this up i remember it being a little bit pink yes it is still a little bit pink look how pretty that is for some reason, it reminds me of those toy lipsticks that we had back in the 80s and 90s. Oh, I think I'm smelling the jojoba, but it has like this slight, almost smells like shea butter actually, because it has that buttery popcorn scent to it. It doesn't say that has shea, but it has that almost like a buttery popcorn type of a scent to it, which is actually pleasantly surprising. I wasn't expecting that at all from this particular product but let's do a swatch now and it's supposed to have just a very very light shiny yeah it's that ever so slight right there ever so slight of a shine which means that you can wear this alone or you can wear this underneath other products you can wear use this as a night mask whatever you want so let's test this out on my lips now oh it feels so soft on your lips Oh, wow. Mmm. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Nice. Oh, it feels so good. It just melts onto your lips. It's just like, ooh, this yumminess. Wow. Let's just see what it tastes like, though. I don't taste much. If I have to do, like, a taste comparison, this definitely wins. <laughs> It literally just feels, gosh, I can't even think of the word for it. It's like a layer of love on your lips. It's just, it's so moisturizing. I like how this makes my lips naturally look, to be honest with you. I think it's, it's a very, 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 very pretty look just on its own. So if you're looking for something that's not too shiny, just a little bit shiny, it just feels, it gives a look of a nice clear gloss, but no stickiness, no tackiness whatsoever. It just feels feels good it just feels good oh my gosh i think it just enhances your natural lip color i don't think it's like changing my lip color at all mind you my lips are a little bit more more 
vibrant right now because I just did a scrub. Wow, I'm really enjoying it. Okay, the final part of this, I wanna see how everything lays under my, my usual lip products. I'm not using something that I expect to stay on all day. Normally, if I put on a balm or anything and then I try to use like, let's say the the Mattitude, the, the, it will still give my lips color, but it doesn't, it's not, it doesn't become transfer free. So it will transfer because of that. Now, however, with that said, the product that I'm using today, it's not a transfer free product. It is a beautiful color. Um, again, this is the Cashmere Lip Cream in Plush Peony, just to see how it lies on top. No, it's still quite bright, actually. Yeah. I think that is also not quite as bright as if I was just using this on its own. But guys, how my lips feel right now is pretty ridiculously incredible. So yes, I I really, I actually really love this. This, I like. I do like this. I love this. Yeah, the Glimmer Lip Polish, I like it and I don't love it is because... I think that the, the vitamin C one did pretty much the same. And I'm kind of super in love with the vitamin C one. Um, but I mean, we can do a tete a tete, a, a head to head with these products. If you would like for me to, just let me know in the comment section to do a comparison of these two. So this is a good lip scrub. It's not overly abrasive with, in the sense that it was like big chunks of sugar. It was very fine, which was quite nice. Yeah, and it tasted nice, which is nice. And I do like the scent of this one because of the berry scent. But if you want me to do uh, a comparison on the two, the vitamin C versus the FMG one, let me know and I can make that happen. This lip conditioner though, guys, holy wow, it feels so good. And lipstick does wear well on top of it. I think it does make it a little bit more of a sheer coverage as opposed to a medium coverage, but I'm perfectly happy with that because that's usually how I like my lips to look anyways. So if you're interested in learning more about these products, make sure you do go to the a link in the description box below. If you have any questions, leave a comment or find me on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and I will do my very best to answer any questions that you may have. If you're interested in learning more about becoming an Avon Beauty Boss, jump over to my other channel, Passions to Paycheck with Jessica Yick, and there you can find a little bit more information about joining Avon as well as how to take your passion for products for beauty, for makeup, and turn that into a paycheck, guys. I love you guys so very, very much. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, guys, be sure to remember to stay well, stay safe, and stay fantastic. Kind. See you in the next one. Bye!